So we got the super toxic Huntress build coming at you. But if you don't know what the super toxic Huntress build is, it uses insta downs with some very annoying perks to face when you have an insta down with an ebony mori. Because you can't be toxic without an ebony mori. So what we got here is we got knockout. So when I down someone, anyone that's outside of 16 meters of them won't be able to see the down person unless they have like bond or empathy or things like that. Then we got hex ruin. Slow the game down just a little bit because I want to kind of have fun with the survivors at the same time as downing them. I don't want to kill them right away, but I also don't want them getting the generators right away. Then we got deer stalker. So within 36 meters, I'll be able to see the downed survivors auras. It just allows me to be able to leave them if I need to go down someone else quick. Then we got barbecue and chili. So when I hook a survivor, anyone 40 meters or more away, I'll be able to see the auras for four seconds and then stack up a bonus of 25% for each individual survivor hooked up to 100% for blood points. And then for add-ons, we got the iridescent head. So hit them with an ax, they're down, one shot. And then we got infantry belt. So if I didn't have infantry belt, it'd be one hatchet. Now it's three hatchets. So now I got three tries to be able to hit someone down. I'm probably going to potato a lot of those. And then we got an offering of an ebony memento mori so that we can go ahead and be toxic as shit whenever we want to be and smack people in the head with our giant axe right here that we got. So I realized I only had two mori as a huntress. <clears throat> and I used both of them up on uh, games where people disconnected in the beginning of the game. But I did have a really funny mori of a lorry in a box. Bye. Right. Bye. <laughs> Mori in a box! Hey, what a great surprise. What's in the box? What's in the box? Lori's body, that's what's in the box. I found it quite hilarious. So now we are using a blackboard. Did I hear a box? Using a black word, we're hoping that uh, we can do some slugs. Did you run this way? Oh. You almost stopped it with the pallet. Kind of sucks that we don't have our Mori, though. I was enjoying it. I could use single Moris, but that's no fun. So I might as well, I'm just gonna keep my because I have 15 black wards. I might as well use them up. Oh man. I thought he was gonna sit behind me, but he's gonna go unhook him. There's a hook right here, though. We only got one hatchet left. But we know where both of these guys are. Now we got zero hatchets left. Could've went for the guy that was hurt already, but no point. Gonna get our hatchets. This guy is still running. Still running. Still running. Oh, you got balanced landing. Hmm. Ooh. If I waited for it just for a second longer, I could have actually got him pretty nice. Ooh. Ooh. Now we got no hatches left. Now we gotta smack you down. You gotta come back here, little missy. At least they're throwing shit down. Well, he's throwing shit down. 
Get your dirty ass back here. He's running to the loop. There's two of them here. He got my totem, which kind of sucks, but it's okay. Huh. Fucking fat shamed. <laughs> fat shamed, okay. I don't even know where he was. I wasn't looking at him. Well, that was interesting. I know where you're going. I almost hit him too. Let's get this hatchet. I know where you're going, little missy. Don't you worry. I was really hoping someone was going to come and try to try to pick him up. But we'll be able to see people. One over there, one over there, one over there. He's going to get that generator. I don't really care about that gen. I'll just walk at you with a hatchet. Super toxic. Corn blindness is a real thing, you know. I swear it is. I didn't even check to see where people were. That's what I get for forgetting. Let's go upstairs, because I'm pretty sure this guy either has to be upstairs or he's getting that gen upstairs. He's not. He was over there getting him. That was a bad idea, sitting there healing. You should have you should have moved away. That was a little off. Oh, I almost hit him. Well, we do have all four of our barbecue and chili stacks. That's something. I'll break this. I have no problem with that. It's not going to do anything. Well, I did run into a rock, but still. Corn blindness is a real thing, boys. Corn blindness is actually a real thing. Don't make fun of people for it. It's not nice. Not bad. 
found you, you little shit. Oh my god, I'm a potato. I'm a potato. It's clinically proven. Now, if the hatch actually spawned right in there, or like right under him, I would cry. But I'm still right here, so he wouldn't be able to make it. It's all good, though. I'm a potato, and potatoes never lose. Only sometimes. Potato Monto never loses. Get that right. Only sometimes. <laughs> I don't know why you guys weren't doing gens. Like, there's gens halfway done, but then you guys got off of them to go save people. Which kind of helped me in the end. Got a map and a key. Nice. Very nice indeed. So we got ourselves a Mori from the blood web. And we're in Mother's Dwelling. What a good map to worry some people. So let's see if we can get this shit done. Don't fucking disconnect, you pieces of shit. I will find you. I will find you. Don't you worry. If you even think about pressing that leave button or telling your mom to pull the plug, I will find out where you live. Dirty little shits. Did I just see someone through the bush? Nope, that was a totem. My to my my totem is probably gonna break soon. I told you. Dwight, you're over here. I know you are. You can't. You know, the funny thing is that Mechazawa guy. There was this one game where he fucking sandbagged me. Because I unhooked myself. I wish I had that footage. I was playing with my girlfriend. And I was just playing farming. And he sandbagged me because I unhooked myself. This game, this game, I love it. I love it. My Mori is wasted because of you little shits. Didn't, I tried to not let it go, but I did. Is anyone else gonna leave? All right, last guy, come on, leave. Just, just do it. Just fucking do it. Just goddamn do it. I'm waiting. Oh man, this game's so funny sometimes. Hey, super toxic build, making them disconnect. I can't complain. This is literally the definition of super toxic. I have no hatchets left. I'm just gonna run your ass down, you know what? Run your ass down, get your ass over here. <laughs> Bitch! I'm super toxic. <laughs> I'm 
I'm super toxic. Disconnect right now. Do it. Do it. I'm waiting. That'll be the day when I get four disconnects in a super toxic build. That'll be the day. I enjoyed this little segment that we've had today. I'm gonna have to fucking play another game. <laughs> and I don't have a Mori, so that was the last one. I was the only one that I got from the blood web. <sighs> sad. Super toxic, but super sad at the same time. <laughs> well, that last game was pretty fun, but guess who we got in the game again? <laughs> Let's see if he disconnects. <laughs> He's the Dwight, so if he disconnects, this will be too fucking funny. <laughs> he checked my name, he's like, nope. <laughs> Oh man, it's not super toxic with those some disconnects. I saw him go this way. Oh, there you are. Wait, I faced this guy earlier today too. No, that was in the last... That was in the last video where he disconnected after he used the game map. <laughs> oh man, this game is so fucking funny sometimes. He's like, come kill me, please. I just want to die. I thought you wanted to die. You wanted to die, right? Are you going to disconnect too? You want to... Okay, oh, you want to go on the hook. Okay. I understand. God damn it. Just die already. Yes. Yes. Just accept your fate. Everyone else did it. Why not you do it too? Uh, now we gotta play another one. God damn it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh. Ah, shit. This game is too funny sometimes. Now I have two videos of this guy disconnecting. And two games of that guy disconnecting. Run free, my hatchet friend! Or fly free! <laughs> all these games are fun and all, but let's not have any more DC. <laughs> not until the game actually starts. Like, come on, guys. I don't want to... I want to have some, some fun in the sun with my boys and girls. Where's my, where's my totem? Oh, back there. Okay. Well, okay. Well, that works too. I can deal with that. Thing is, I won't be able to... That sprint burst though. Mm. You're keeping me around this guy. Oh yeah. Ooh. 
He just sandbagged the shit out of you. I'm still coming after you. Don't you worry. Never mind. There's a pallet. I could have swung through that. I'm gonna leave him. He doesn't think I know where he's going, but I got Deerstalker. And I will find you. Don't you worry. Didn't even see. Oh, you bitch! You killed yourself. Didn't even see that there was a tree there. He threw down the pallet. <laughs> it just goes to show he doesn't look behind him. Almost hit the box. If I would put it to the side a little bit more, it would have hit him. I'm coming for you. You best believe it. He went out this way. Hey. No breaking my totems. Not even the dull ones. I just realized I have no hatchets. He's pushed in there. He's on the run. Get him, boys! I will chase you down like the dog you are. I will chase you. I will chase you. I will chase you. Get me my hatchets. Well, at least he didn't. He killed himself. He didn't DC. That's always nice, I guess. I got the barbecue and chili stack. Hi there. Are you prepared to die? 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 Are, are, are you prepared to die? I hope you're prepared to die. Pretty sure I would have hurt him if he dropped down. Did you, did you run at me? Did, was that intentional? I hope it was. Oh, he did drop down. Interesting. Oh, no, they ran. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and gals. Did they run? They, should, they couldn't have ran far. No, you healed yourself. He healed you a little bit. He ran, and then you healed yourself. I get it now. I understand. Don't you dare disconnect. I need this barbecue and chili. Oh, I see him. I see him. Don't you worry. I got eyes and ears and nose and mouth.
The thing is, where did he go? That is the question. Did he drop down into my basement? Probably not. But I will check anyway. <laughs> he did go down into my basement. I was wrong. He was dumber than I thought. If he was smart, he would have just kept going this way. Would have just kept leaving. Went out somewhere else. Even sat behind here. All right then. Well, that concludes our morning announcement. I'm your boy, Monto. And I hope you enjoyed this wreckage and DC fest of goodness. <laughs> I'm just all about this money. I don't think about no thighs. Girl, you don't know about me. So get off my fucking D. Born and raised in the dot. This is real as you gon' see. You see, you don't know about me. So get off my fucking D.